What's good YouTube? This is your boy The Wise Bro. I'm back at it again you guys. 2019 is finally here. I'm so happy and delighted. But today you guys, I'm going to bring you something a little bit different from my normal shoe reviews and clothes reviews and so forth. We're going to talk about beard growth, okay? Now beard growth for a lot of people is very difficult. There are a lot of guys out there that are trying to grow beards, the ones with the little stumpy on the side, you know little Mr. Stumpy on the side where they got the little gaps and so forth. That's very frustrating and I can feel you. And I'm gonna give you a few pointers and tips on how to grow your beard in full, nice, and have it looking really plush. So that when you go out on the town, you're looking like a fly guy, you know what I'm saying? Fly guy. That was kind of corny. Anyway, 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 anyway. Now, I don't know if a lot of you know that beard growth is very hard, all right? There's certain androgens that it depends on in order to happen. Now, um, one androgen in particular is called dihydro, dihydro testosterone. Now, that's uh, DHT for all of you out there that don't know the acronym for it. And basically, DHT is responsible for it's the follicles in your beard that help your beard grow, okay? And uh, that's primarily what it's for. So now, what I like to use, all right, I'm gonna tell you some of the oils that I like to use and uh, some of the uh, conditioners I like to use and some of the bombs I like to use to help accentuate that growth, okay? Now, peppermint oil is very, very essential for beard growth, okay? Beard growth, because it does not block those receptors, those follicle receptors in your beard, all right? And it's a very natural uh, way of getting your beard to respond, okay? So what I'm gonna do in this video is I'm gonna go over a variety of uh, products that I use to get that beard to really come out, to really thicken up, and to look very, very plush and uh, shiny and healthy, okay? So um, one thing in particular I, I do have to stress though, um, a lot of people do not drink enough water. Now, water is essential for everything, okay? Water is very essential for everything in the body, okay? As you know, our body is made up more than 70% of water, so think about it for a moment and, you know, it's very essential. It's just very essential. So water will help. Um, there's a whole lot of other things that you can use. Biotin is another good uh, um, supplement that you can also use to, you know, to get your hair to grow, your facial hair, your 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 um your nails, all kinds of things. So just do your research and uh, see what products are out there. But I have the one products that um, I'm going to show you that will work for you. Uh, you will not be disappointed at all. So without further ado, you guys, let's go ahead and get into the meat and potatoes of how to grow a beard. Arr. All right, these are the essential oils that I use for my beard, for my beard care. And I'm telling you guys, these work wonderfully. What you wanna do first is you wanna turn the warm water on, get that washcloth nice and wet, Make sure you get a lot of water in it because it's gonna go in the beard and it's gonna really get it nice and soft, all right? All right, first thing you wanna do is you wanna apply that nice warm cloth to your bottom of your face, to the bottom of your chin. Hold it on there for about 10 to 15 seconds and really get that, that water and all that moisture into the beard. That's gonna really help accentuate the, the beard and get those oils to stay in the beard and lock those, those oils in and conditioners. Next, you wanna also do the front of your face. Get it nice and moist. I'm telling you guys, the more you get it warmed up and moist, the better off these oils are gonna be getting into your face. Now, hold it there the last time here between two to three minutes so that you get it nice and soft and ready for the oils to go in and the conditioners and the bomb. All right, the first one I'm gonna use is this Beard Oil by Cremo. Very good, I love this oil. Goes in really, really thin, nice. I put about two to three drops on my hand to get it really nice. And I rub my hands together for about five to 10 seconds. Then I go ahead and I put it, rub it into my beard really, really good. You wanna get the front, you wanna get the, the sides and the front of your beard. Make sure you get it all around and really push those, those, those oils into the beard. Next here I have some Argan Oil from Morocco. This is another really, really good product. I got this product at Walmart, and I'm telling you right now, it works wonders. Two to three squirts in the hand, rub it in just like all the other oils, the other oil that I showed you, and it's gonna really do some real good here. Next, you have the Jamaican Black Castor Oil with Peppermint. I really like to put more than what the regular, the a lot of amount is, and I rub that in really, really nicely. Goes in good, and I like to rub my hands together, my, my face with this for about good five to 10 seconds. Next, I have some Shea Moisture and Monocle Honey. And this is a really good type of butter, shea butter. I love it, I love it. Makes my beard feel so good. It also gives it kind of like a full feeling. Next I have some Fortify here. This is another type of conditioner. And um, this one is kind of goes on 
uh, at first white, but then as you rub it in, it really gets under the, the beard, under the under the, 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 the skin, really nice. Next, I have some jelly oil here. Another nice oily based uh, type of oil, more so like a conditioner. And then here we go with the beard bombs. I have three different types and I use all three. Now the beard bombs are gonna lock in all the oils and all the conditioners that you put on your face. It's gonna keep them in so that they don't escape. And I'm telling you right now, it feels really, really well. I get about a little bit on my finger, as you can see there, and I rub them in really, really well. Make sure you rub it in all on the sides, all on your, in the front part of your mouth, where all the hairs are. Next, I have a hard side and a soft side brush. Um, I picked this up from Sally's. Uh, they have a large assortment of them, and uh, you also can get them from Walmart or Target. From there, I go ahead and brush the hair down, brush them down on the soft side, and make sure the hairs are laying flat. Next, I get a nice little edger here, and I kind of clean up the area. Now, cleaning up the area is going to really give you uh, that really nice uh, plush look, and also is going to help the hair grow. And the more you cut it, of course, you're going to get the new follicles in. So that way, I can kind of gauge of you know how much hair is growing. Next, I get a nice, nice fine-tuned razor, and I clean up the neck area, really make it look nice. And here you got it, you guys. I'm one pretty motherfucker, man. Look at that. Look at that. Look at the. enjoyable i hope everybody got all the information they need to grow that super fly beard for all you guys out there struggling to grow these beards man step up your game man and use some of those products that i told you about or i showed you in this video okay if you like this video remember to comment like and subscribe to my youtube channel you guys got a lot more content coming out i know i took a couple months off man but you know we get busy now you know that and stuff so i'm i'm just trying to make it man in this world today you know we got crazy things going on but anyway man peace love and harmony in 2019 and beyond yo we about to do a big bigger things better things stay stay dedicated stay motivated stay determined to your passion man and that's about it so uh yeah if you like this video go ahead and hit that notification bell for my channel and that'll let you know when all these other videos that I'm going to be putting out are coming out. So uh, anyway, you guys, peace, love, and harmony. I'm out. And stay tuned to the next video. Right, hold on a minute. I bet you guys are wondering, wait a minute. Didn't you have a different set of glasses on a few scenes ago? Anyway, man, that's all in the editing, man. That's all in the editing. But let me know, you guys. Let me know about the video if you liked it or not. And that's it. I'm out. Peace.